to get right to that breaking news overnight. The situation growing worse near Basalt, where the Lake Christine fire is growing. A look at these new pictures just in overnight. These show just how close the flames are burning to town. Overnight, two neighborhoods were told to leave. The second round of evacuations came after the sheriff's office said the fire activity was stabilizing. And the Lake Christine fire is just one of several fires burning across Colorado right now. Hey, this map shows where at least eight fires are burning right now. They include the longest burning fire in our state, the 416 fire, and the largest burning one, the Spring Fire. Denver 7's Eric Lufer joins us in studio. And Eric, the situation is getting very serious near Basalt. And we want to get straight to this map, the new evacuations, the burn zone you saw there. These squiggly lines are the road closures northwest of the fire, the Missouri Heights neighborhood and homes east of Upper Cattle Creek Road. At this hour, we understand a total of 500 homes are in the path of this fire. Here's what we know so far at 646. The fire has burned around 2,700 acres. At last report, it was 0% contained. Eagle County will be turning the fire over to the state, which will bring in more funding and resources. A type two team has been ordered. No word exactly when that changeover will happen. Firefighters are saying this is the worst fire they've seen in the area since the 1994 South Canyon fire on Storm King Mountain. 14 wildland firefighters were killed in that fire. The Lake Christine fire crossed over into National Forest Service land just yesterday. You can see images here. There was an emergency closure for the entire area. Now we're going to take a live look right now at what's going on. This is going to be in Carbondale near Basalt there. You can see the fires definitely uh, laid down a little bit because of the cooler temperatures overnight, but you can see all the haze. And of course, Mother Nature has not been cooperating. It could be another tough day on the fire lines today, Molly. All right, Eric, thank you. And today, more people who live near the Spring Fire in Costilla and Huerfano counties will learn whether their homes have been lost to the fire. The last report has the fire at more than 95,000 acres. It is only 5% contained. Fire bosses say they expect their next update to top 100,000 acres.